Now at five, Metro Police make an arrest after a deadly shooting in downtown Indianapolis. The shooting happened outside Lucas Oil Stadium Monday night. CBS 4's Jesse Wells explains what led to an arrest being made in this case. The deadly shooting here outside Lucas Oil Stadium marked the second homicide already this year in downtown. But because both of those cases resulted in a quick arrest, police hope that sends a message to everyone that visits downtown. Just before 10 o'clock Monday night, 35 year old Donnie Lee Sanders was shot to death on the sidewalk outside Lucas Oil Stadium. Immediately after that shooting, police claim the killer was caught on surveillance cameras walking into the Indiana Convention Center. With the help of that video, police confirmed Wednesday morning they arrested 25 year old Elijah Hayes for the murder. Back in January, 50 year old Cornelius Coleman was stabbed to death on South Illinois in downtown. Court records show police use cameras in the area to quickly track down and the arrest the suspect in that murder, 30 year old Nicholas Radford. Police say both cases illustrate that violence in downtown won't be tolerated. If you choose to hurt someone or harm someone, you will be held accountable and responsible. And the message is also, you're not only hurting the victim's family or the victim, but you're hurting yourself because we're going to hold you accountable. While surveillance cameras are already a common sight in downtown, this year the mayor's office promises more mobile public safety cameras and a new grant program that can help businesses cover the cost to enroll in the B-Link camera system. At the same time, IMPD insists downtown crime remains relatively low compared to the rest of the city. Downtown is a safe place, obviously we know. Um, we put uh, multiple sources as far as, or resources, I'm sorry, in the downtown area, whether that's from technology, um, additional officers whenever we have events and other things going on throughout the downtown corridor. While Sanders worked at Lucas Oil, so far police won't confirm what led to the shooting. Neither Lucas Oil or the convention center were open to the public Monday night. Finally, Hayes is being held without bond at the Marion County Jail pending the filing of formal murder charges. Jesse Wells, CBS 4 News. Jesse, thank you.